Assalamu alaikum, this is Mr. Mudathir from Legacy School and this is Seesaw for parents and students. If you don't have Seesaw on your cell phone, go to the Play Store and download it. If you're using an iPhone, go to your iStore and download it over there. To download the app, simply search for the word Seesaw and it will come at the first result. Download the app and get ready to sign up. The app will show up on your menu just like this. Tap on it to start. As a student you need to tap on I am a student over here. You will get this screen. What you need to do is tap on Google slash email sign in at the bottom of the screen. If you have a Gmail account you can go ahead and tap here. If you have a different email account type in your username and password over here. Choose the account which you, which you wish to use Seesaw with. There is a menu to your left that contains all of your classes, but if you're using Seesaw for the first time, this menu will be empty. What you need to do is add classes. To add a class, you must have the code provided by the teacher. Type in the code and, and tap go. You can scroll between classes by simply tapping on the class. This is the journal screen. But you will find all of your lessons here in activities. As you can see, these are all of the lessons in this class. If you want to start your class or your lesson, simply tap on the lesson and tap again to start learning. The lesson could be images or videos. Let's try to see how the video would look like. To start watching a video, tap on play. The video will take a couple of seconds to load, but then you will be ready to learn. To respond to a teacher or send your homework, tap on Add Response here. You will get several tools which helps you to send your homework. If you have your homework on a piece of paper, simply you can use the photo over here to take a picture of your homework. If it's a simple homework, you can draw or you can record yourself with this tool over here. But if you have a file that contains your homework, a DOC or a PDF, you can simply upload it from here. I hope that was informative. Have a happy learning. Bye.